Kanye West is having an especially tough time with Kim Kardashian's decision to solidify their divorce on Friday. The 43-year-old rapper has reportedly been incredibly distant and unresponsive amid the end of his marriage with the Keeping Up with the Kardashians. A source told Us Weekly that although he knew it was coming, the reality of the situation has been weighing heavy on him as Kim has always been trying to keep himself busy. The runaway singer has been trying to throw himself into work the past few weeks, as it is to Kim was always Kanye's dream girl, even before they got together, so the thought of her not being his wife anymore is a lot to take in, and ultimately he is not sure whether it's the best decision for their family or not. The so though they only officially became a couple in 2012, Kanye had been outspoken of his admiration for the reality. The rapper said in a 2013 Hot 97 radio interview, I loved her from the first day I saw her. He continued, our love story is a love story for the ages. I felt like when we first got together, it was like a Romeo and Juliet kind of thing, where it's like, she's a reality star and I'm in an interview with Kris Jenner in 2013, during the time she had a talk show, he told his soon-to-be mother-in-law, there's times when I wasn't with, Kim, I wanted to be with her so bad I thought about taking up sports. Kanye was referring to all of Kim's past boyfriends being athletes. The pair began dating and she got pregnant. Four months after she was born he pulled out all the stops for an epic proposal slipping a 13 karat diamond ring on her face. They continued to get married in 2014 and started their life officially as Kim Ye, coming as close to royalty as America could get. Four years after marrying things began to go downhill, however. Though it was only reported within the past few months that the two had been living separate lives on account of a downright toxic environment at home, reportedly Kim had been past the point of no return for nearly three years. Kanye lists quotes about his relationship with Kim over the years in an interview with Hot 97 in 2013 calling I loved her from the first day I saw her, which I said I remember seeing pictures of her in Paris Hilton in Australia, and I came and I was like, man, have you ever seen Kim Kardashian? What's up with Kim Kardashian? In the same interview he also said okay, ladies and gentlemen, all barber shops, fashion designers, architects, corner stores, Wall Street, all over the world. Y'all acting like this ain't the most beautiful woman of all time. I'm talking, like, arguably of human existence, the top 10 of human. On mother-in-law Kris Jenner's chat show in 2013 colon there's times when I wasn't with, Kim, I wanted to be with her so bad I thought about taking up. I was in love with her before I was ever able to talk with her. Don in a 2014 Vogue interview Kim is like a fantasy. She's like a dream girl and I think a dream girl should live in a dream world to W Magazine in 2013 colon nobody can tell my girl. She just needed to be given some platform of information to work from. One beautiful thing is that as she discovers it, the world is to Ryan Seacrest in 2013 colon there's no way Kim Kardashian shouldn't be on the cover of Vogue. She's like the most intriguing woman. She's got Barbara Walters calling her like every day and collectively we're the most influential with clothing. No one is looking at what President Barack Obama is wearing. Michelle Obama cannot Instagram a pic like what my girl Instagrammed the other day. Our love story is like a love story for all ages. When we first got together it was like a Romeo and Juliet kind of thing, where it's like she's a reality star and I'm a rap advertisement a source told us weekly. The turning point in the marriage was when he said back in 2018 that slavery was a choice that the statement caused a nearly insurmountable rough patch, despite the outburst being tied to his fraught mental state and bipolar disorder, as Kim was left mortified over his comment. Though they were able to rebuild past it, his proneness to outrageous outbursts continued to cause tension in the marriage, and it came to a head over the summer when he made comments about Kim and their firstborn daughter knowing, I almost killed my daughter. So even if my wife were to divorce me after this speech, she brought North into the world, even when I didn't want to, he said in a speech while bidding for president as part of the afterwards he took to Twitter and now infamous outburst where he proclaimed that Kim tried to lock him up with a doctor, before insinuating she had been unfaithful. He continued I've been trying to get divorced since Kim met with Meek at the Waldorf for pre That was her breaking point, in the marriage according to a source. She was able to brush off things that he said for shock value in the past, but she was in over her head as soon as he brought their children. From there, they were never able to get back to the place they were once in. In July she met with her divorce attorney Laura Wasser for the first By the fall they were not in contact, and despite a last grandiose gesture of gifting five my buck during Christmas things were basic. By 2021 she had begun to slip off her wedding ring and was focusing on the It was then reported that divorce was imminent for the pair, and were living apart. Shortly thereafter he was seen moving belongings out of their shared house. Now with divorce papers served, though no date of separation was listed, she is seeking joint legal and physical custody of their four kids and they are in the process of splitting up all their assets fairly, having both 